we've had it with New England where this is the, I would say it's the first time we've had people really getting upset about the lyrics. We wrote lyrics that are aimed at the, the man on the street and these are the things you're doing wrong and this, you know, is it you can't change or is it you won't change? And mm. all the songs before that were more aimed at like a bigger entity, a government or something mm. like they're doing this, they're doing this. And this was our first song that we put out that is kind of being more like, look at yourself and see what people you People have could, taken that person. And people take that personally. Know. And I, Why, I was like... <laughs> right, here we go. Killer Keller podcast, live and direct. Central London, or central as you need to be. Big shout out to everybody who's got Keller Vision app. GraffitiKings.com. We salute all day, every day. Um, not to mention all the regulars sharing is caring. Without you, we don't make, we don't make moves. We, we're trying to make signature moves out here. This is like the WWF <laughs> of signature moves. We're doing it. Um, yeah, central as you need to be. Inside the place, we do have two gentlemen from a, from a collective that I can only describe as this uh, uh, London hybrid of punk meets rap meets grime and you know this this is an age-old fable of where uh, musical balls gets to transition over some of the more hardcore um, adoptees and genres well yeah these guys are doing it right now and uh, i've been a fan for a minute big shout out here's ben and jack <laughs> Kid yeah. Nice to meet you all. Nice to meet you all. Nice to see you. Hello, sir. Pleasure to be here. Cheers, 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 cheers. And thanks for coming down. There definitely, thing. there definitely feels like there's a lot of musing mm. in in and reflection in the lyrics that you, you, it's it, there's a sense of irony as well. Yeah. Oh, we we always are like the message is there, and it's one that we truly believe. But one thing we like to do is firstly we don't take ourselves too seriously, and we don't want anyone to take us too seriously, and. We always say it's got to be tongue in cheek because otherwise there's that fine line between being preachy or mm. being, you know, something that people find enjoyable to listen to. And we don't want to be preachy at all because, Kid preachy. you know, when they say when you point a <laughs> finger, at, <laughs> when you point a finger at someone, you've got three pointing back at you. Mm. And it's very true. And whenever we write anything, we always think that, you know, like, we always like if you're like, say, like, you know, something like it or whatever, any that's the one example. No, but but it's it is true. true where you go like. Some of these lyrics that are scathing, you're like, mate, we've been there, we've would, done that. And do you know what? Yeah, true, true. With, with, you know with I mean? New yeah, England, you've experienced it. We've had it with New England where this is the, I would say it's the first time we've had people really getting upset about the lyrics. And we were like, what's different? This is it's the same thing we we're always talking about. And what you said is you said, this is the first time that we wrote lyrics that are aimed at the the man on the street and these are the things you're doing wrong and this you know is it you can't change or is it you won't change and mm. all the songs before that were more aimed at like a bigger entity a government or something mm. like they're doing this they're doing this and this was our first song that we put out that is kind of being more like look at yourself and see what people you have could, taken that person and people take that personally know. and I, why I was like, though well because they are that person you know like there's this guy let's say one example like kicking off in you know a comment section or whatever and you see it and you know, you kind of just look at it and you just go, you're demonstrating that the song is is true. Mm -hmm. Do you know what I mean? Mm -hmm. Like, you are the character and, and that's why you're taking this personally is because, like, you're the person it, it, People take it personally when, mm -hmm. when, they, when you see a bit of yourself, it hurts, doesn't it? Mm -hmm. When you see something and you hear something and especially when it comes from someone that you like and then you kind of feel like the thing is being pointed at you a little bit, it hurts. It's like, mm. and that's a good thing. You need that in your life. Challenge. Otherwise, what's the point? Mm. What is the point? You need someone to kind of go... Tough love. Yeah, a little bit of tough love. And But at the same time, like, it's all of us. Like, it's, we're, all, we're all guilty of being... Certain things. Certain you know things I mean? at certain times. And, like, you know, it's... it's um, we always are like, we know that we're, we're all like that. You know, no one's perfect. But that was interesting to see that with, with mate, those. On social I, media, I was happy man. with that. I was like, cool. Yeah, I'm glad that people, this is pissing mm -hmm. people off. Because people don't really like... Social media has sort of created a world in which people don't really agree with being challenged. Like, you know, mm. whatever those algorithms do, they create echo chambers for you. And mm. it's not really a place you go to be challenged. So if something's coming up, like you're a fan of ours maybe and then our music comes up, but it's giving you a message that you're not used Don't to seeing because with. it is challenging you. Mm. It's like, that's not, that. it's good to have that out yeah. there. And, and that, that, we're definitely not the only people doing that. Music that challenges people, and there's loads of it at the moment, yeah. is so important. It's very easy for, people, yeah, you know? and it's very easy for that to be taken away. From, like you said, the echo chamber is like, everyone's pleasant, mm -hmm. but it doesn't pay to be pleasant. It doesn't, no, exactly. doesn't help anyone. Um, also, talking of the same, in the, the same direction, like to have, to have hate creates, friction the friction leads to fire it like we always 
forget about the the goods when you see one hate. Mm-hmm. And, yeah, uh, yeah. But you kind of need it on balance. You yeah. need people. You, the haters love you too, and they love you so much. Like you got to give them a performance. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, yeah, I, right. t- yeah I no. totally agree, mate. Give them a performance. Yeah, you know? absolutely. That's what you got to do. Totally agree, mm-hmm. man. Mm-hmm. Big shout, out Bob Villain. Yes, to Bob Villain, man. 100%. Yeah, Bob Bob Villain's an absolute legend, man. Like, yeah, man. Um, I'm so glad he. Uh, when me and he Ben was wrote, up for it. Yeah, yeah, well, yeah. when me and, me and Ben wrote that song, that was like one of the first songs we wrote off of that album. Um, and we were like, okay, this is a new direction, but felt like a really good one that we wanted to explore. Mm. Um, and we straight away were like, Bob Villain. We've yeah, got to get Bob Villain on this. And we asked him and he just straight away was like, love that, it. It's all of his core principles. Mm. Into one. It was wicked. Yeah. We, we couldn't, to pick someone that you really want to work with and, you know, you expect to maybe go through like three or four options before someone's like, all right, I'll do it. But he was just, and he's blown up as well, doing massive stuff. Like, yeah, he's and you sent that 32 and it was just instantly like, mate, amazing. We, yeah, yeah, there it was, was just not, like, not a single note. Please, thank you. Know you. I mean? Yeah, yeah, yeah exactly. Exactly. I was worried, you know, someone's sending something and you don't want to, he's a lyricist, I'm not going to, so I don't want right, to be like, whatever, oh, I don't know about this, but he literally every single, what mm. you hear on that track is mm. what he sent. And it was just like, I loved Amazing. it so much. Do you, about, the, do you think about Bob Villains? Like, because I quizzed him on a couple of his tunes where he's gone proper to the, to the bank with, with the grind bars. Yeah. And they go, yeah, but you don't understand. I spend the whole of a project writing them. I'm not like a Skepta. I'm mm-hmm. not like a, um, a Getz. And I'm like, yeah, but I'm going to be really brutally honest. I think he's better than that. <laughs> he's than sick, him. man. That song you did, that GDP song as well that yeah. recently came out, I was just like, he's just, like I said, he's been absolutely blown up, but he's in that exact crossover of like, is it punk? Is it grime? Like, mm. do you know what I mean? He's supporting the offspring, but then he's also like doing all these other gigs and like putting out the music he puts out. I love mm. that crossover so mm. much. It's, I think the new, sort of, I don't know, like the new interpretation of what like, you know, punk or band music or whatever it is, mm. it's like it's everything's melted together and mm. everything's, Modernized and it's the fresh version. It's, it's become, the Renaissance. Do you know it's what I mean? Less about, it's like, do you know what I mean? It's become less about like right being like, grime's got to yeah. be beat driven and and punk's got to be fresh in the guitar. It's it's more just an attitude now, isn't it? Yeah. It's it's more like you know, multi genre kind of. Crossover. New England it's doesn't like, have a single mm. guitar in it, really, does yeah, it? Yeah, exactly. But it, but still, it's it's a punk song and it's mm. you know that's what I like. It's it feels like more of a uh, an attitude than anything. You know, speaking out and. Like we always say in these like rough times, that's when like that music flourishes. So mm. God knows what's going to happen when things get better. The music, what are we going to write about? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs>